All right, today we're going to explore working with two AI tools to, and having them work together. Uh, so we've got ChatGPT and Suno, and we're going to use ChatGPT to come up with prompts for Suno and then go back and forth between the two to kind of demonstrate by hand how two tools can work together. Eventually, we're going to get to having this happen automatically with AI or with, with APIs. If you think about it, um, if you know what APIs are, they're application pro programming interfaces, and they're what systems use today to have one system talk to another. Whenever you're coding and you're, and you're writing something, um, if you need to do something special, often you'll call out to an API and have the API handle the details of that specific task. Something like, you know, there's, there's APIs for sign-in, there's APIs for taking credit cards like Stripe. Uh, there's all kinds of things out there. There's APIs for generating images. Um, in the future, I think, though, those APIs will become AI-centric and prompt-centric. Uh, so this is just doing that kind of process by hand where we can see that one tool can make a prompt for another tool, that other tool can act on it, and then give us some, some data back, and they can work together. So let's do that by hand today. So I've got this prompt in chat GPT. I'm playing with a new AI tool called Suno. It's that one we did in the other video. Um, to make, here's, here's what a prompt looks like. I want to do a rap battle for my YouTube channel. Uh, help us out. So let's see what ChatGPT does for the, the prompt. So it's thinking, uh, running the input through the neural net and giving us things back. Here's the rap battle prompt. Barbecue sauce recipes. Oh, it gave us a few. Watch Sir Rhymes a Lot face off against McQuack and humus rap battle over who's the better pet owner. Oh, it's giving us a bunch. Let's do this this one when it stops. Okay, let's, let's see how this one goes. Okay, so I just took that out and then create. I was playing with this a minute ago. So I've put this in here. So now there's just putting that in and creating. So in the future, future videos, we'll do this. We can use tools like Langchain to take, uh, put input in one system into the chain get the output of that, and then move that output as input into other pieces of the system, and either have it go back and forth until we're happy with the result, or have it just do a pipeline sort of thing. So, it, you know, we'll see. We got the pet rap battle, bouncy and playful. Let's let's hear what it sounds like. Yo, it's so rhymes a lot, the pet on the supreme. Got a furry crew straight out of your wildest dream. My cat, she's so chill. Got tricks that'll amaze. She flips in the air, super acrobatic display. MC Crack, you better watch and learn. I'm the owner extraordinaire. No concerns. My dog's got skills you can't comprehend. She catches frisbees mid -air. Honestly, I don't like this one very much. All right, that, I, I don't know. Let, let's let's see the other one. It, it makes two so that you can compare. Let, let's see if this is any better. Yo, it sir rhymes a lot. I like the beat better. Got a furry crew straight out of your wildest dream. My cat, she's so chill. Got tricks that'll amaze. She flips in the air. Super acrobatic display. MC Quack, you better watch and learn. I'm the owner, extraordinaire, no concerns. My dog's got skills you can't comprehend. She catches frisbees midair like she's born to defend. Me and my pets, break it all back up. This is so much better. So we got that. I'm gonna take the, the words and put them back in ChatGPT. This this tool made us some cover art, but let's have ChatGPT 
GP, I always get it mixed up and I'm sorry, uh, GPT, which is uh, Generative Pre-Trained Transformer. Um, let's, let's have that make the cover art. Just to show you can go back and forth. Um, so that one system can have output that you put in as input to the other, and then that output could go back to do other things with others. And you can have limitless numbers of, of tools in this chain. It could be straight like a pipeline, or you could have it fan out and do different uh, artifacts, and then you could have them, something assemble them when it's all together. So we'll explore all these patterns in later videos, but I wanted to show by hand conceptually what you can do to make these systems interact and make new things. So here's what ChatGPT came up with with the cover art. I think that's actually better than what Suno is doing, in my opinion. Anyway, th thanks for watching and like and subscribe. If you're interested in learning about AI, I've started a school, S-K-O-O-L. Put that, check the channel. Join it. We're going from almost nothing beginners with AI, going to make ourselves world class. So um, follow me. Uh, I'll be your guide. I am a principal architect, software you have used or probably have used in the past. Um, and I've been in the space for a long time. I know what it takes to learn from nothing to world class. And uh, I'll be sharing that along the way as we go. Uh, and making myself world-class at these new AI tools as well. So thanks for joining, uh, and stay tuned.